Hello and Namaste. In continuation with the linear algebra topic matrices, we have started with the singular uh, similarity and diagonalization. We have already done two parts for the diagonalization. Uh, actually, in fact, three parts on diagonalization and similarity. One for the concepts, all the concepts of similarity, diagonalization, and so many algebraic multiplicity, uh, geometric multiplicity. That was the concept. Second was the diagonalization part one, wherein we have discussed on the eigenvalues which are distinct. about the diagonalization of that kind of uh, matrices second we have discussed on the uh, eigen values which are repeated but yes still the matrix is diagonalizable now let us move ahead with the part 3 we are dealing here with the different kind of examples which we have not done in part 1 or part 2 so capital a is this 1 2 2 0 2 1 minus 1 2 2 that is 3 cross 3 matrix check whether the matrix is diagonalizable comma diagonalize if it is now same thing we have to do it we have to find out the eigen values and vectors for this but before that we have to go for values and for that reason we need to use make use of this equation out of that we need to find out this value value of this and value of this so this summation of ai is 5 summation of mii is coming out to be 8 determinant of a is coming out to be 4 you can just check it check this out uh, pause the video try to get these values on your own and then that's the reason we have got it lambda cube minus 5 lambda square plus 8 lambda minus 4 is equals to 0 because of this that's the equation we have got the values as 1 comma 2 comma 2 again if you can check it here lambda is equals to 1 is having the algebraic multiplicity as 1 that means what the value 1 is repeated only once algebraic multiplicity of 2 is 2 because it is repeated for two times here for two times in this set of eigen values that's the reason our, our target is to check what is the geometric multiplicity of this 2 we need not to bother about geometric uh, multiplicity of this 1 because it has it will be 1 it will coincide in fact because it's a distinct it's not repeated but for algebraic multiplicity of 2 we have to check the geometric multiplicity of 2 only if they are equal then only we can say that this particular matrix is diagonalizable otherwise we can't say that that's the reason we will have to go for the uh, for the geometric multiplicity of 2 first that means we have to go and find out the eigen vector corresponding to this 2 first then it's a repeated value so for lambda equals to 2 it's a a minus 2 times i into x is equals to 0 we are doing the simple matrix subtraction will receive this particular matrix here then because of this as value is repeated we have to go for roe echelon form we have got the roe echelon form we got the rank of this particular matrix is 2 why because we have got 1 and 2 as the two uh, non zero rows in this particular echelon form and therefore the number of parameters or in fact it's same as the number of linearly independent vectors corresponding to eigen value is n minus r that is three variables minus the rank is 2 that is 1 so we have got it here as the one uh, this uh, number of linearly independent vectors means what for this particular vector or for this particular lambda equals to 2 value we have got the geometric multiplicity is of 2 is equals to 1 but algebraic multiplicity of 2 is equals to 2 therefore we can conclude here algebraic multiplicity of 2 which is not equals to the geometric multiplicity of 2 and hence we have to say that the capital a is not diagonalizable or few of them are saying it's non diagonalizable it's one and the same we need not to actually find out this one vector over here even we need not to find out the eigen vector corresponding to the other value that is of 1 so we are not uh, not at all finding out because we have got the answer here only we will have to stop at this type of questions here only we need not to find out the vector corresponding to lambda equals to 1 even we did not to even find out the lambda this this vector corresponding to lambda equals to to in this case because the question is check diagonalizable we are saying no it's not diagonalizable if it is not we need not to diagonalize it we can't diagonalize it so moving ahead with the, the another question it's of little different that what we have done in the, the previous 
I'll just go quickly with summation of AII, summation of MII, then determinant. So we got 3, 3, 1 as the respective values. We are putting it here in this. We got the uh, the equation, Cartesian equation as lambda q minus 3 lambda square plus 3 lambda minus 1 is equals to 0. And hence we got the values as lambda equals to 1 comma 1 comma 1. That is 1 is repeated 3 times. That means the algebraic multiplicity of 1 is equals to 3. We do not have any other value than this 1. Therefore, again, as I have to told you before, as the eigenvalue value 1 is repeated or repeated, we need to check the geometric multiplicity of this 2, of this 1 here. It has to come as 3. If it is coming out to be 3, then it's fine. Otherwise, we have to say that it's non diagonalizable Let us let us see what will happen. And this is, as this lambda equals to 1 is repeated, we have to say this a minus i times i into x is equals to 0. A simple subtraction will give rise to this matrix here. This is the matrix we are going to get it. Then after going for the rho echelon form, you can just go ahead with this particular and if you will observe here, the rank of this particular matrix is coming out to be 2 because of number of non-zero rows. So we got first non-zero row, second non-zero row. So we got here 2 number of non-zero rows. The value of small r is 2, but the small value of small n in this case is 3, that is x, y, z, 3 variables we have. Therefore, the number of parameters, that is number of linearly independent vectors corresponding to eigenvalue lambda equals to 1 is only 1 because of n minus r, 3 minus 2 is 1. Therefore, we can say that geometric multiplicity of 1 is 1, but algebraic is 3. That means they are not coinciding. That means they are not equal. If they are not equal, the capital A is non-diagonalizable or otherwise we cannot diagonalize the matrix or otherwise we can't write the capital M for this type of matrices. Wherever the, the condition, condition arises like this. Algebraic multiplicity is not equal to geometric multiplicity of all the eigenvalues of a given A. If it is not equal, the matrix is non-diagonalizable. Follow the previous session from this I button or from the end screen or just go and surf the channel on the uh, channel. You will get it the playlist of uh, linear algebra. Under that, you will be able to see starting from the types of matrices, what exactly the matrix still this point. Everything, all, everything about the linear algebra. Even you can just go for this type of concepts and you can solve the gate examination, TOEFL or a CAT type of exam examinations. I have created all these stations in such a way that all the basic concepts are there on the channel. Yeah, and this is a self-observation slide. I have purposely taken a lot of time over this because uh, this is three matrices along with this. It's, it's a last row is 0, 0, 2. It is 0, 0, 2. Let me just... Do it here, make it here myself, make it move up here. So that it's it's this matrix is 0, 0, 2 and you can just check it over here. Every time uh, all these three matrices I have given as a practice what we have done it here in this. Do practice. Let me know in the comment section. If at all any doubt, please get back to me. I am always available. Thank you. Happy learning.